Hi Legionnaires and welcome back. We're here with another episode of uh, this 11 AD French campaign. And thank you so much for the support in the past episode. We smashed that uh, 10 like boundary and we're now uh, going to do another episode and show off this mod even more and hopefully expand the French nation even more, which will be excellent if we can do so. Um, one thing I just realised that's happened is uh, Flanders has expanded and taken Troyes from, Sh I think it was Champagne, the county of Champagne. So um, that's happened. That's the only change I've seen evidently so far. The plan is um, in this episode to take La Havre from uh, Normandy. So we take this whole whole region. And that'll be excellent if we can do that. Um, so I'm building up an army here to uh, do that. That should probably be enough and we'll strike next uh, turn. I think five. Yeah, I think we've got enough. Um, I might hire some mercenaries and then get rid of them. This army uh, hopefully will start retraining next turn. If not, then uh, we've got some problems. But hopefully that happens. Um, I'm going to... There's somewhere I could build a... Ah, yes, here. I could do a church parish. Or we could possibly do um, a small convent. Um, I don't know. I'm going to do... Hmm... Hmm, I don't know. I think I'm going to do St. Benedictine uh, one, I think. I think that's the only one that's really going to give me much of a bonus in this region. Anyway, we'll end the turn and we'll uh, see what happens in this end turn. Probably not a lot because we're not at war with anyone now. Yep, absolutely nothing. There you go. Our hidden agent's been discovered though. Uh, recruit a champion. Uh, I will do so eventually. So you're still not doing anything. So we've got cavalry. They've got cavalry. We've got a lot of skirmish cavalry and they've got British spearmen. I think my guys generally are better. I think Frankish spears are better. Uh, but don't quote me on it. I think they are though. What's this? Motivated population in Aquitania. Excellent. Do we even have any land in Aquitania? Also, why can I all of a sudden see these guys? Oh, we have Poitiers, of course, yes. So we do have a bit of land. Um, but yeah. I think I'm going to move in. Move in to that side. I don't care if I'm trespassing. Uh, Nate, can you please... I want you on food, please. Because we need some food. Nate's is going to be chief food production. Are you now retraining? No. Why are you still not retraining? It says recent events. Why are you not retraining? Do I... I'm tempted to move you on. He's still not going to do anything. Let's just move you outside. That makes that happier, I guess. Um, I'm going to move the, these guys on. Just see what happens. I'm just really confused. What does recent events mean for why replenishment can't happen? Because that's kind of annoying. I'd kind of like some replenishment. Um, I guess it slows down your, expan uh, your expansion if your army's... Uh, take longer to like retrain I guess I'm not sure it's very strange um, what was I doing and tax labor okay so I'm getting more growth okay that, that's fine um, I think after this I am going to go for Aquitaine so I'm going to go and put my spy down south Clermont uh, and then I'm going to end the turn when she gets there. actually no let's see if we can do any trade with anyone would Leon and Castile now like trade? Be welcome here and speak as you no. Because they don't. Be welcome here no, because speak. there's no option. The only people that will do it are those that are like in France. And I want to take them out. We want to unite France. Oh, we're at war with... Oh, they're at war with the Holy Roman Empire. Interesting. Be welcome. Well, then it shall be my interest to ally up with the Empire by going to war with Hungary at some point. And Britain, well, Britain, England is the only other kingdom that would do anything, and they don't want it right now. So that's really rude of them. Uh, okay, so we'll just end the turn, and we will see what happens. So many factions, but it's so ex it's just excellent that there's so many factions to play through. Hopefully they will become playable at some point. There we go, research done. So we now have uh, more growth. I'm going to probably go down... 
go down siege, build a workshop, um, potentially, or I don't know. This this one also looks quite. I kind of want to keep going down. Oh, water sluicing. Um, oh the, yeah, that's kind of handy. I kind of like that. What's that? Mercenary upkeep costs plus one tax rate. Scholarship. Okay. Um, I think I'm gonna go down organized supply first, because then I get. I know it brings down my tax rate, but it also brings down my upkeep and cost of armies. That should be key. Why is it taking forever to just get to here? Wow, it's like the movement is terrible. Apparently, I, I don't think I can hit it this turn. Well, we'll just stand there. Uh, okay, everything's encouraged here. What was that? Household expense, chief overseer. Okay, you're still not replenishing. Still not replenishing, hey? I'm going to move you back towards Le Mans still. Um, I'm going to keep you on the road because I don't know if attrition is going to do anything. That's very interesting. And I'm going to be... If I have to merge everything, that's going to be annoying. Um, I mean, if anyone that's involved in the mod can let me know what recent events has got to do with it. That would be very much appreciated because um, I have no clue. Not a clue. Um, okay, so I could do that, but I would then run out of food. I'm very low on food, so I'm waiting on these two to kind of finish what they have to do. Um, and mains, can you do anything? No, not as yet. Poitiers is the only other region, and they're doing stuff currently. We may run out of food very soon. Wait, so that's two turns. That's two turns. A mains, are you doing anything? Two turns as well. Okay, we might be okay. He says. So if you're enjoying this uh, Let's Play, by the way, please remember to like and subscribe because I'd really like to hit uh, 450 very, very soon. Oh, well, yes, I'm sorry I didn't do it in time. Population surplus. Excellent, right. So I think here I'm also going to build a farm. Um, get more farm stuff going. That means Nate's farm should be... What? Ooh, interesting. So Homestead here takes one turn. So I'm wondering... I'm going to send this army south because... I wonder whether it takes short... Yeah, so they replenish here. Ah, is it because there's been a war going on in this region? Possibly. I don't know. I wonder. That must be it. Harsh winter... It's been a hot. Oh, this is a mild winter. Has it got something to do with winter then? That's why it wasn't replenishing. Surely not. Hmm. Oh, it's going to take a long time for some of these units to replenish. Wow. I don't know if I can really wait around for that. Especially like Frankish swords. Oh, that's not good. Um, I might need to just get rid of them and uh, put some other units in there. Which is a shame. Anyway, we will declare war on Normandy. I think I can take Norm. Oh, apparently not. Well, I'll, um, I'm will i going to do the same as I did last time. I'm going to encircle, and I will let them do their thing. I could hire a load of uh, cavalry, but I'm not going to do that. They're uh, very expensive. Um, and I don't think I'm going to do much else. I'll look at diplomacy one more time. Try and... Gets. Uh, the thing is, I'm not discovering anyone. Burgundy. Can I do anything with Burgundy? Military access? No, I didn't think so. I'll give you some money for uh, defensive alliance. Oh, they, they. Yeah, there you go. Right. So yeah, we'll do that. Do a defensive alliance. I don't really want to go after them yet. I may break that alliance at a later date, or I might um, I might go to war with the Empire or England, obviously. Go to war with England. But we've got to unite France first. One step at a time. One step at a time, Pope. You're getting excited. So as I expected, they attacked. Oh, they did produce some stuff. Their stuff is a lot worse than mine. So I have belief in my, my troops that we can win this. So I will fight this battle. And I will see you guys on the battlefield. Hi guys, so we're back on the battlefield now, and I just realized in this uh, army that we have the crossbows in here, so we can finally see what they look like. 
and uh, and also have a look at how they're going to fight in, in this battle. Are they going to be better than these? Well, I hope they're going to be better than these light cross uh, these light archers because they cost so much. But uh, they look pretty good. I mean, their officer. Look at that officer. That he looks. He's ready for battle. Look at him. He's jumping around. He's like, yes, just get me in there, boys. I'll kill them all. No, you won't. You're going to be just commanding your uh, your archer company, and you're going to be hoping that you don't get shot. That must be the worst job, just thinking about it now. You've, you're an officer, you've got a sword and a, and a shield, but you're with archers. you just got to sit, stand there and just pray that your, uh, that your shield basically does the job and you don't die from uh, a random arrow while your men around you shoot and kill everything. Oh, there's a nice little town here. Let's go into the town. Let's go and raise this, burn it to the ground. Um, okay, so as expected, Normandy is uh, moving all its troops back to join up with the slot. But these are all light swordsmen, so who cares about these guys? We'll run them down. Um, you can all move up again. Just keep moving. Move all the way there. It's uh, also... I mean, the AI is picking perfect weather for me. Now it's foggy and snowy. But uh, And the last one was rain. So here they come, though. Okay, actually, maybe they, maybe they might attack. These are uh, mounted skirmishes. They look pretty damn nasty. They could do some. Robert Kurt Hose. The third. See, heavy, heavy riders. Right, they're going to be the first target. I'm going to try and take them out. He's already coming over. The AI is playing a bit dumb, and it's just going to try and go for it. So I'll. Um, I won't give him a second chance. Actually, I don't know. Oh, no, maybe not. I'm not going to run into those spears. Not a good idea, and there the general's gone and saved himself. So, I think we out. Oh, we might outnumber them on archers. One, two, three, four, five, six. No, maybe not them. But I mean, some of them are horse archers. They have javies, so they probably aren't all too great. But I'm sure we can do this with the quality of troops we have. I believe. Um, right. Are we in range? No, not as yet. No, okay, we'll move forward a little bit more. Like an inch. Oh, actually, maybe not. They're gonna, just going to come into range now. Perfect, so we'll do that. Um, oh, spears. Um, I don't really want to engage these guys because they... But at the same time, I kind of need to because they're threatening that flank. Uh, I'm going to move them around here. I'm going to try and get their general in the arches and all this terrible stuff in the back. We may have to alter the angle of that unit on the end. And I don't know where all the... Oh, okay. Their cavalry's still there. Hopefully the general reacts to my cavalry coming here and goes for a silly charge. Yes. But, oh, no. He's gone and got hidden. Uh, maybe an idea to charge these arches. Charge all these guys. Cut these guys down. Um, you should be running. Yep, yeah, good. I was going to say, they should definitely start running. They're cowards. Um, let's just... Oh, yep, yeah, the general's come in. Right, perfect. I mean, it's not really... I kind of want to pull him out. We didn't do enough damage. Oh, and, yep, yeah, as expected, they are... This is going to be a sticky operation. Um, but we have far too much stuff on this side, on this left side. So I'm going to swing these guys, these ones around. And bring them over here. Um, the men are wavering. Where? Oh, the light spears. Uh, not light spears, light cav. Oh, they're going to get cut down. Excellent. Not what I needed. Frankish Light Cavalry. Not needing you running away now. I needed you to go and cut down all those archers. Um, okay, so you need to hold, like, really badly. Um, you go this way. You go this way. We're going to flank them hard on the left. Oh, we've got spears up here still. We had a lot of sp Oh, you need to go in here now. Okay, we might not win this. This could be a, a French defeat. Uh, no, we can run down those archers again. And we'll try and get their general. Um, focus these guys down. Focus their ar horse archers down. Okay, they're going to try and charge my... 
Yeah, go in here. You should start to win that. Prolonged melee, you should win that. Uh, okay, yeah, they're fleeing because of overwhelming numbers. Oh, I should have got some mercenaries. They'd have been handy. Um, can you just focus these guys down, please? Flo focus down. What have we got over here? More arches. Wow, just... I've out-positioned myself, really. I should have... Yeah, just frenzy charge. Um, excellent. Spears, get in there. Okay, you... Well, did those cavalry break? I think they might have. Um, yeah, just keep running away. Don't let them engage. Um, I'm going to try and encircle all these here. And then we can progress from there. But these spears really need to hold. Like, I know you're light spears and all, but just hold. Where's the general? Is he running guys down? He is. Um, archers, can you focus the general down by any chance? I'd like that if you could. We also just have a spear unit out there. That's fine. They can keep chasing my archers. Excellent. Go to the back of those archers. Try and break them quickly. Um, well, they're going to send in their mounted skirmishes. Interesting. And my men flee the field. Oh, because of those goddamn general. Okay, not great. Um, this could be... This is not looking great, guys. I'm not going to lie. Um, focus their general down. Kill the general. Oh, well, these light swordsmen are doing work. I need, I need to kill their general. Can we rally? No, none of these guys will. Pro these are probably all broken. There, yeah, they've routed. Um, rally my men, I guess. Right. Oh, come on. The, yeah, finally, these guys are broken. They're routing. Shoot them, shoot them. Lock these guys in combat. Oh, that's a good volley. Okay, keep killing them, keep killing them. Oh, I thought he's broken. Yes, he's breaking now. Okay, he's breaking now. We can possibly do this. Who are you, light archers? You're running out of space. Go over here. Uh, general? General? Where are you? What are you doing? Oh, get out of there. Get out of there. Get out of there. Okay, now you need to go down here. Um, archers, focus those archers down. Um, spears, oh, spears back, yes, oh gosh, yes, thank god. Okay, you're a high threat now. Um, we need to kill archers, lots of archer killing. Oh, and they broke, damn it. Um, lots of archer killing and lots of... Just lots of killing, just kill everyone, please. Murder these guys. Oh, come on. Kill these guys. Kill these guys. Come on. These are mounted skirmishes. You should not be... Come on. Bowman out of ammo. Okay. We'll go into the combat. You've got to go in. Uh, right. Break these guys. Oh, these guys could be in a situation. Uh, kill those ones. Right, keep killing. Alright, kill Liam. Oh, did, oh, the general broke. Damn it. Was not paying attention. I thought he was fine. I thought we had that combat there. Well, it looks like we... It's not looking good. It's not looking good. All that we had over them was that their general was broken. Uh, that, if that light cavalry hadn't broken earlier, I think it might have been okay. I was probably a little bit too aggressive with them, but I mean, we could still possibly do this. They're low tier units, lots of bows. It's whether we can kill that cavalry off quick enough. Where are they? There's 30 of them. There's probably too many of them. Yeah, that's all the spears gone. Oh, if you can break all these, if this unit here can hold these guys off, that would be brilliant. Um, shoot them. Shoot these guys in the side, please. There's such an easy target. Where's that other unit of archers? Get over here. We're going to need you. I mean, I don't know if you're going to be able to save the day, but there's always hope. Okay, these spears haven't quite broken. They're going to. Yep, that's them gone. Oh. 
the king's army might need to be going uh, north to go and deal with this lot instead. But it's an, abs it's an absolute route now. It's not looking good. Um, are any of you out of ammo? No, not quite. Kill these guys. Kill these guys. Oh, the crossbowmen. Oh, yeah, of course. Not good. Get these out, Get these guys out, and then we might have a chance. But it's unlikely. It's really unlikely. I mean, we've broken them there. Goes the chance. Run. Actually, no, you got to hold. Hold these guys. Crossbows. There's so many of them, though. There's too many. Which used all its ammo? Oh, this one. If only I'd sent them in instead of the crossbows. But the crossbows are just getting gunned down now. Well, gunned down, but cut down. Right. Uh, oh, it's not looking good. It could be the first defeat of the campaign. Yeah, that's not looking good. Uh, it's not helping when they're having to send in archers to try and beat spears and swords. But I mean, oh, there's there's probably a lot of friendly fire going on in there as well. Like, a lot. And those crossbows were probably doing a lot of armor piercing and killing a lot. And now they're just getting... Oh, there's 42 of them left. Some of them might get out and be able to revive that unit. Probably not, though. Might have to just build a mercenary army and send it. Um, back, which is really annoying, but it's we've got to do what we've got to do. Okay, we've broken this unit or wavering this unit, and this one. Oh, okay, but they're breaking. When there's a glimmer of hope, and then your units go and ruin it. Stop cutting down my crossbows as well. Yeah, okay. Who's used all their ammo now? You. But you go and hold them up. You go and help hold them up. Yep, go in. You've got plenty of ammo to get burned through. Alright, but yeah. Excellent. Kill these ones. Oh, these are the lights. These are... Is that the general? That is the general. I wonder if this is the reason why their morale's lasting a bit longer. If I kill this guy, will they all break? I wonder. Possibly. Oh, they're breaking now. Interesting. Oh, this is a close battle. Don't you dare come up here and kill my men. Oh, it's possible. No, because now they're running away. That's all it takes. I mean, these are guys breaking now. Oh, as soon as I say anything, they just... That's it, they break. Yeah. You were losing slightly and you still break to. And. Ah! You were winning that fight! You were winning that fight! That is ridiculous. Right. Uh, I'm just going to ask you to break because. Just get you off the battlefield. I might just. Uh, I might just surrender, concede defeats because otherwise, it's just. Running around. I don't think I can win that. So, unfortunately, that is what's going to happen. Oh, that entire arch unit got cut down. Oh, that's annoying. Anyway, I will see you back on the campaign map. And we will uh, reassess our losses in a minute, guys. So, here we are. We've lost three units. Two Frankish spears. And a light archer. So, it's not the end of the world. Um, so, the cavalry got out. but And so did my general. But unfortunately, that is that is a pretty major loss. So I'm going to retreat to a mains or maybe Le Mans. And we will try and... I'll probably merge units. They want me to join a war. Maybe we'd offer a lot of money. I'm going to say no because <laughs> uh, I don't really want to have to go to war with them just yet. I've got other I've got other fish to fry first. A daughter comes of age. Isadora. Well, let's have, let's have a look at the faction, actually. Isadora. Okay. Well, can you marry someone? Uh, no. No marriage. There's no husband. Yeah, I can't arrange a marriage either. That's a shame. Oh, well. Okay. So, we will bring the army here. That's under Louis' control. 
back to it's just such slow movement through this region I'm gonna have to pull back to here and I'm not gonna get any uh, replenishment because of because of reasons okay so it's gonna still take 11 turns uh, so no, 11 turns yeah to uh, replenish these guys yikes um, I will send them in there the King's army so I'll, I'll retreat to uh, Le Mans We've done enough damage now. I think we could actually probably merge some of these guys. And none of these guys are really too uh, well trained. So we'll do that. We'll merge some guys. I might just disband these. Leave it with that. And then recruit. Uh, I don't really want to recruit these really good cavalry just yet. I'd rather get some. There's just so much. It's 1400. Um, which I could be spending elsewhere probably. Um, probably could I could just replace those Frankish light cavalry actually peasant militia and Frankish spears always a possibility as well um, how long is this like recent event thing going to last then the elite means I can't retrain here because recent events just says that it doesn't say why I cannot it doesn't say how long it, it is like still going to last because that would be handy to see how long it lasts if I they want to go and cam carry on campaigning in that region. Um, because otherwise I'm going to just run out of regions that I can just like start uh, replenishing in. Uh, basically, <laughs> it's going to just be don't exp don't attack anyone because you can't. Um, County of Provence. I don't know why I'm do I don't know why I'm looking at stuff. I don't want to do it. Yeah, I've rejected it so many times now. They're just like no, don't want your smelly. Uh, your smelly trade agreements. That's just not on. We're not having that now. Um, so we will just. Ca I think I'll just end the turn. I will just. We'll see what Normandy does. I think Normandy probably is not going to do a lot because they're going to probably start making an army now and coming for me. Uh, let's see. Probably nothing. I think we've gone past them. It's going so quick, and there's so many. Yeah, they've definitely not done anything of interest. So maybe I want to keep this... Oh, I'll keep it in Clermont for now. I mean, there's just going to be nothing there. Um, I'm going to put... Hmm. Put water... Oh, actually, no, I don't know if I want water sluicing on yet. I'd li I'll go military settlement, actually. Um, because I'd like to get even better troops. Um, we're going to take you off that... Uh, yeah, see, I, my general now can't retrain. That's so annoying. Peasant militia. They actually cost a lot. Apparently, these they have no missile damage, obviously. Uh, melee attack is better. Um, what's morale like? Base morale is not very good. Great axes probably is the unit I want to be getting like the most of. I want to replace... Uh, yeah... I cannot recruit this unit. Why can I not recruit this unit? Oh, I've already recruited the maximum number of this unit. Wow. Okay, so that's that's it. That's all you can do. Interest. That's well. It's interesting. Also, kind of annoying. Um, I'm going to replace. Well, get some more cavalry. I'm going to bring some great axes and more Frankish uh, spears. That is the plan. And then, how long... Oh, well, that's a problem. They're not going to... Oh, and now Troyes has been taken by the Holy Roman Empire. So I will have to go to war with them at some point. But I'm not yet. I'm in no fit state to go to war with them yet. Um, Poitiers. I probably will build a... Grain mill. I might bring the King's Army up. It's, it's tempting, but at the same time they don't retrain. And they're happily retraining down here. And they don't... Yeah... Yeah, that's actually actually that's a point. Is there anywhere any of no it's, it was this one, Poitiers. Um any of these do replenishment. Yes, the grain mill does replenishment. So we need to we need to do that one. So I need to build this needs to become a grain mill just to try and help with replenishment because I don't know how long this recent events thing lasts. And it's annoying me already. Um I'm not yeah, I have just no idea. Late spring. Okay. Interesting. I have a lot of money. Um don't know what to spend it on. I'm gonna not spend it on anything 
there. Could spend it on something here. Don't really want to upset. I've got a nice um, sort of, I guess, norm on what's going on. Like everything's, everyone likes me to a certain degree. I'm, I might secure the loyalty of these guys while we're here. That costs a lot, actually, the papal pie. So I guess that's not a bad idea to do it now. I know I'm protected for eight more turns, but get their loyalty up anyway. Always a good idea. Um, and um, yeah, I just I need to. Maybe go back to our mains to just replenish. Because this is really annoying. This recent events thing. I, I've said it like ten times now, but still. Right. No, I'm not. I'm not joining you in your wars for the Holy Roman Emperor. Even though he's not holy or an emperor. Or or Roman. That's the other one. Um, carry training and carry horsemen. Uh, rally horsemen, please. Uh, population surplus in Belgica. Well, we'll do something here. Um, I could build... Oh, yeah, I could build a main square. I still haven't actually got these ones. Workshop and water channel. I'm sure water channel, yeah, basically just does that. Wor um, main square I'm interested in. Uh, grain trader. Ooh, wine trader. Traveler's lodge. Street jesters. Slave trader. Um, library is fairly good. I think I'll go, yeah, I'll get one of these going. Um, a square, a main square. Um, we'll get one of them going. Oh, it's a lot of growth going on in Belgium. Good to see. And you're still not replenishing. How many more turns? Okay, we're going to put a grain mill in here as well. That takes seven turns. Blimey. I might have to send this army. I'm going to send this army north because it's fairly well trained up now, apart from this one unit. I'm going to send it north and we're going to try and deal with uh, Normandy. Pro that would probably be a better move. And apparently it takes forever now to move across the world. I'm pretty sure that wasn't the case. But yeah, we now are getting not much public support because we've got lots of armies in this region, I guess. That's the reason why. So we'll get a move on, and we'll uh, try and do some more stuff. No, uh, just stay away. I know you've got a lot of money that you can offer me. I'll take your money when I've finished all this, all these wars here. Right, so you keep moving. Okay, well now we can move a quiet way. We'll move up here. Recent events say we still can't replenish. So annoying. Um, I'm going to replace my crossbows, I think. Uh, they did get... Oh, well, they're actually going to get the same... I'll get rid of those ones and just put these ones in place. So we have a proper army going again. And then let's just get some normal air uh, spears. Even those cavalry, they're just not even worth holding on to. Okay, that's it. Um, war declared. Who's at war? Aragon and Castile. And an energy recruit, recruit load of stuff. Okay. So no wonder my money's gone ridiculously down. Um, grain mill is going to be made. That's going to be made. Uh, and that's it. We'll just end the turn again. There's a lot of turns I'm going through, but there's not a lot to do at the moment. I just want to go on, take La Havre, and then be done with it. See, they're gonna they're gonna raise the price every single time. Is that the ho that, wow? The Holy Roman Empire is well, obviously, is a long got a lot, but I'm gonna have to go to war with them at some point because they have a lot of stuff. They probably have a lot of armies. They might take Burgundy. Okay, Burgundy took Troyes. I didn't see that. Lays Le Mans has a great fire. Oh, brilliant. At least it gives me something to spend my money on, I guess. Still no replenishment because of recent events. Excellent. Um, we'll attack. Oh, my good God. I might need both armies. Or I might need to recruit some mercenaries, which we don't have. Um, okay, guys, this is going to be interesting. I mean, these lights are... I might just... Hmm. If I stay there, let them just come out to me, and then they might retreat. So, grain mill is done. So, we now have a lot of stuff going on down here. I could probably put in this. Put in a St. Edmund's church. Probably could also put one over in, like, over here somewhere. 
Um, but I don't really want to. Say I'm in church, could go here. Cost me four food. We are losing a lot of... Why are we losing this at the moment? It's just because of... Yeah, because of the fire. God damn it, fire. Um, What does that do for me at the moment? Oh, yes, I'm going to get pikemen. Auxiliary British horsemen in it? Okay. I might need to go back to our mains and get stuff from here. Ah, it's just frustrating. I don't know how long this recent events thing lasts. Does, I don't even know where it would say, like, that it, like, is, doesn't happen anymore. Um, but it's not going to say it here. Kingdom. Oh, I could become an empire. I could do that. Uh, well, empire is quite good. I could try and change to an empire. Maybe. Maybe. Just add more loyalty. But this is good more public order per turn. Interesting. We'll see. We'll see about that. Um. Oh, and you've had a kid, and now you had a bastard uh, because you've not got married, and I can't seem to marry you to anyone. Because apparently this is not allowed. Apparently you don't have any gravitas. Well, there, have some gravitas per turn. So you can start marriage. Oh, there you go. A couple have married. Who have you married? You married this guy. Who the hell's that guy? Let's seek your promotion. And let's get you married. Well, apparently I can't marry you. You've not got any grav. You've not got enough. Blimey neck. I try. Oh, we could marry you, Constance. There you go. You got a marriage. Uh, to some guy. <laughs> who knows who this guy is? Um, we'll get you some promotion as well. There we go. Um, and we could declare heir, but my heir is going to be Philip, and I don't care. Philip's nearly of age. Actually, he's not. He's just eight. He's very not of age, but he's a, he is my heir. Louis is not allowed to be my heir. Um, and then I will end the turn one final time, and we'll see what happens, because we are coming up to the half an hour mark, I think. Yep, here we go. I'm going to retreat here. Um, I'm going to see if they'll attack. They will. Apparently, I still don't stand a chance. Interesting. So these are all light archers. Their general is very weak. And they have the Theoden. It's Theoden. He's come from Rohan. Um, see, I think I've got a decent chance here. These are all light swordsmen. These are all pretty weak. If I lose this battle, God help us. I think we've got a good chance, so we'll we'll fight this battle, and we'll see what happens. So I will see you on the battlefield, guys. So we're back on the battlefield. It's raining again. Blooming weather is never good here in France, it would seem. But we've got our army. The king's army is here, and it looks magnificent, to be honest. I'm not going to lie to you, and I don't know why that's appearing. Look at these boys. They're ready. This time, we've gone for a more narrow formation, and we're going to try and win it that way. So we'll see what happens. Um, I'm going to try and focus down their general. And kill him because he's on such low health. Um, and then we're going to find out if Theoden arrives. <laughs> I just like that he's called Theoden. Um, oh no. Well, it's just Theoden. He's on foot. He's not got any cavalry. Um, okay, so actually they have a lot of archers out here. We could possibly run those guys down. That might be an idea. Um, but I want you to pull back. Because they are actually attacking. So we should probably just be passive. <gasps> Run for the hills. There's a lot of them just there. Get back, get back, get back. Right, so you go out here, you go here, you go here, you go here. I'm not going to let them stand and engage my guys. These guys can do a bit of a flank. Um, and we'll see what happens with the rest. Uh, if I, their general gets any close, even close, I will. Right, I need my general around this side because they've not defending these archers. And their general's here. The men are wavering? Oh god, these light spears are awful. They did okay in the last episode. Ugh. Chase these guys down. Don't just stand there. Um, commit these guys. Good God. 
Now they're breaking. Um, Frank is swords. This is not a good sign. Defeat after defeat at this rate. That is bloody useless. Blummin' useless, these guys. I had such high praise for my men in the in the last battle, but not in this one. This is a uh, a shocking display. Okay, so swords are very good. General, can you get up here? Run these guys down. Oh, there's chaos in the middle. There's a lot of chaos going on. Right, their general's near. I could hear him. My spears need to get back. I didn't realize they'd gone that far. Kill their general. Kill their general. Focus all these guys down. There's so many here to kill. Yes, I know our general's under attack. But he's going to do well. He's going to kill these guys. Come on. Oh, come on, infantry. Stand and fight, man. It's just a few men with pointy swords. I would show you close-up, guys. I'm sorry, but it's this is getting out of hand. There we go. Their general's broken. Their general is gone. Um, you run to the hills. Who's fleeing the battle now? Well, I'm just going to run their archers off the field. Archers seem to be the way to go in this game. Just archers. Get, just get archers. Archers and light swords, because, like, just don't even bring, like, expensive units, it seems. The AI is just saying, don't bring ex expensive units. Just bring swords, like, really cheap swords and really cheap archers. And you win. And it's just a bit dumb. I'm not going to lie. I want my Frankish swords, which I've got, especially at the beginning, to be able to, like, actually do some damage. But they're not. They're just not. I mean, they're still alive. I just feel like there should be a bit more of a punch. Um, can you even just engage these guys? Like, kill these guys. Theoden's still around as well. God, I hate him. Also, these archers, just not breaking. The, mo the most industry... Um, these guys have bro broken. My flank and these guys have returned, though. Excellent. So there we go. We punch through and We are going to win this, I think. Just kill Theoden. Just kill him. Um, right, they've returned. They've gone. You go mow them down. Alright, you do that. Kill these guys. Um, of course. Where are they fleeing now? Oh, here. I mean, I know they're levy spears, but come on. They've got to have a chance. Oh, of course, I'm now getting murdered here. Where are those cav? Get here. They've got so many cavalry. They're not our cavalry, yeah, archers. So much archers. Uh, that was just great English. So much archers. Run these guys down, please. Yep, yeah, right. Well, there's still chaos going on in the back. But we're getting there. These poor... These poor boys are doing... Uh, can you just kill the archers in the rear? Kill these guys. Break these guys. Theoden's lot. Because they won't break otherwise. They're still not going to break. He's finally losing that battle though. Jeez, it's taken a long time. Right, they're going to kill them. Gun these guys down. Who even cares? Just kill. Well, that's fine. They can go. But oh, they've gone berserk all the way over here. Though they're gonna get just murdered. And you, I don't want you over here. Get out. Are you still firing? Yeah, you are. They are now. Okay, fine. There's a lot of breaking going on now for the Norman. The Normans. This is gonna have to mean that we're gonna have a bit of br a little bit of rebuilding, I think, as France, because I cannot afford. Just go away, you stupid archers! Just, I'm gonna build armies full of archers. It's just, it's just the strat. It would seem it's the AI. 
archers and some cheap swords. My great axes have saved the day, I'd say, though. Like, these guys... Uh, they've not even broken all these light swordsmen. That's how insane it is. Oh, don't run away from them. Right, let's get let's get watch this nice cavalry charge. Let's watch this. Charge! You gonna Yep. Okay, that was the, the the worst charge in the history of cavalry charges. Okay, they finally got there. Gun these guys down. We'll run them down as well. Um Oh no, the Blumen's spears are returning. Excellent. Well, you horsemen, go over here, kill these guys, please. Um, cavalry gone, excellent. Kill oh actually no, kill these archers, they're gonna return otherwise. Yep, yeah, look at that, returning as I speak. Kill them. These guys wave actually no, they're not they're not dead. They're broken, but we'll cut them down a bit more. They're broken. Oh yes, okay. I thought they were mine. I was getting very about to get very annoyed if there was more archers to kill, but there aren't. Um, you're not berserk anymore, but you're just getting shot in the back. So we better deal with you um, as quickly as possible. Kill these guys. All right, kill them. Uh, run these guys down. Oh, I think we've done it. I think we've done it. I was so worried for a moment we'd lost another battle. But we've killed these guys. Um, continue for a little bit. Uh, let's speed this up quickly. Kill these light archers. Kill them. They've done so much goddamn pain to me. Those lancers and, those gen and that general has saved me. Just having enough cavalry to run around and do damage. It's really helped. Cavalry, archers, and some cheap swords. All you need, it would seem. So we've killed all them. Look, 104 for a light swordsman unit. It's ridiculous. These guys must be just insane. I mean, these spears are just not worth getting, it would seem. They just break instantly. I might just disband, merge the last lot together, disband the rest, and uh, replace them either with archers or with maybe Frankish spears or great axes. Even though they go berserk, they just seem to kill everything. 307 kills. That's got to be good for something. 486 for the general. That is excellent. Um, but yeah, hopefully that does the job. So I will uh, see you back on the campaign map in a second. Uh, and yeah, well, we've finally beaten these goddamn Normans. So we are back and we have uh, taken some losses, including these Frankish swords, apparently, even though there's a few of them left. Same with these mercenary spears. Uh, it's quite strange that these guys just instantly die, but oh well. Uh, I'm going to kill these guys. I don't care if I get 2,000, 2000 whatever. I'm killing all of them. And then I'm going to get whatever mercenaries. I'm going to march on that goddamn city. And we're going to kill all the rest. So we'll end this turn and I will, uh, and then we'll probably end the episode. Uh, so military settlement. Excellent. Right. So we've done that. Um, I could probably attack La Havre with this army. I would have no chance because apparently that is just a overwhelming odd. So I will probably be hiring those cavalry because we kind of need them now. Uh, and then this army can come up and uh, take out these. So we will uh, auto resolve this one. A 92. Excellent. So we killed them. Hopefully. Oh, they just killed over and died. Perfect. Oh, those light horse died, but they were probably going to die anyway. So, uh, Louis increases in rank. He kills everyone. Excellent. And now we uh, can either siege down La Havre, or we can probably assault. And we probably have a decent... Mm, actually, no, we still have terrible odds. So, we'll, uh, we'll siege them down. They have ten turns. Blimey. Right, so the Grand Army. Uh, well, we're going to give him a commander. And we're going to give these guys um, I'm gonna do general and then I'm also gonna give these guys 
Uh, more spear damage here, please. I need that. Um, and then we're going to go down water sluicing because that's what I was going to do before. So I don't think we can recruit any more mercenaries coming. No, I did not think so. So my army's all here in La Havre. We're going to have to do something about that. I don't know if the blooming uh, thing's still on, but it's going to be on when I take La Havre. So we've not expanded this episode, but we've had a lot of battles. Oh, Leon there. We finally can see Leon and Constance and Salzburg. These all regions that are part of the Empire, perhaps, or like vassals of the Empire, I wonder. Um, but, oh, and we could, ex we'll take, we'll build this while we're here. Um, I don't think any of these are going to help with replenishment. Because I could really do with more of replenishment. But I think I'm going to go with, um, don't, public order's fine here. Could go with grain trader. I think I'm going to go with street jesters, because... Public orders, we could always do with having that because I think I'm going to make this final one an industrial base, um, and that will be that will be it basically. Auxiliary camp, I could get riders with spears and crossbows. Pretty sure I can get an okay army here anyway, but our mains might be my new place of recruiting stuff. Who knows? Actually, that's a point. Can't this already? I thought one of these could already recruit crossbows. No, maybe not. Actually, then that might be worthwhile getting. I'll build the auxiliary camp while we're here then. Um, so yeah, that's where I'm going to end the episode, guys. If you've enjoyed, then please leave a like and subscribe if you want to see more 1180 content. And until next time...